Hey, this is Blind Fox, and welcome back to my little snack review. Please support it and please subscribe and please go and do it on Patreon.com. So, this is a custard slice. And no, I'm not going to eat the whole thing. We just want to. You can see there. Well, there's a sort of a. Um. What is it? Puff pastry layer, custard, and another puff pastry layer, and then there is some icing sugar thrown on top. Now, if you are at home and want to make this, what you normally use instead of the puff pastry is cream crackers, and I most likely sh I've used it in some of my reviews before. It's just sort of a sort of a cracker that has got no salt added. There's no salt in it. It's not a, as sweet as a Mari biscuit, but it's not, um, well, I might just do a review on a cream cracker someday. But so let's see, and the problem with, of course, this is, because it's puff pastry, it's quite hard. So you actually have to cut it with a knife first. So let's just get through this. And there we go. Let's lift this whole thing up. And we can see there we've got some powdered icing sugar on top. There is the puff pastry. There is the custard. Some more puff pastry. And I'm not going to use the fork. It's just going to make too much of a mess. And it's actually nice. You get the sweetness of the custard. Sometimes I put caramel on here. Sometimes you they get, um, as here, you get your sweetness from your powdered icing sugar. I don't think this is just confectioner sugar. So the custard, let's just deconstruct this a little bit. You will see there. The um, puff pastry. And again. Puff pastry on this side with some of the custard. And here we have the custard. Quite thick. Very much not runny at all. Almost like a very thick pudding. For a change, this isn't a very sweet custard slice. When you actually make this at home and use your... Um, what do you call it? Your... your, your Nah, your cream crackers. You also put some icing sugar, sort of not nearly icing sugar, but sort of one of those where you mix your little bit of icing sugar with water, sort of a glaze on top. This just sort of skip the glaze part and just use normal powdered sugar. Well, this is not extraordinarily sweet. I've had sweeter, especially those that got the caramel on top. Very, very sweet. Here the custard isn't too sweet. The puff pastry is just normal puff pastry. It doesn't really puff up that much, but it's still puff pastry. And you get the custard taste. And it's actually quite nice and firm. So this was our custard slice. I've actually seen them where they were more like almost almost like a normal like a Danish type thing, where it is almost like a pie type um, sort of a sort sort of a pie with um, dough all around and the custard inside. But there's different from but this normally is a custard slice. As I said, a nice little slice with pastry at both ends. Or at the top and the bottom, and then the custard in the middle. Like that. So, thanks for watching my little custard slice uh, snack review. I actually wanted to do their interpretation of a... Um, Tiramisu, but they put in a normal chocolate brownie instead and I wasn't going to review that so hopefully I get somewhere some tiramisu still.
So, thanks for watching. Please support the channel. Please subscribe and please can donate on patreon.com.